Hello guys and welcome to a new episode of SnowRunner. Yes, we finally have a new episode. Finally. I know. I'm sorry. Okay, I'm sorry. So, Season 1 has been released. Well, the start of it anyway. It's called Search and Rescue. We have a new map. We have new vehicles. So, of course, we have to do a new video. We have to. Uh, this was honestly like the, the, one of the highlights of the year, this series. But I did get a little bit burnt out, so I just had to just stop. The thought of having to go back to a garage, travel through multiple maps to get to a new destination just haunted me. So, um, yeah, I needed a bit of a rest, but I feel refreshed now. I feel ready to take on Season 1. Oh, look at that. The TUZ-16 is a new vehicle, and I believe we have a scout vehicle as well. The Ford F... 750. Yep, I have to try and find it in Russia somewhere. I have no idea where to go. That power to weight's pretty good though. B plus. I'm gonna have to find that at some point. It's got a very small tank though. That is a slight concern. But yeah, I have to come back. Let me know if you guys happen to know where it is because I've got, I've got no idea whatsoever. There might be a task maybe? But anyway, uh, let's go back to the new map and let's start exploring. Oh, I'm so hyped. I'm so excited. A new map. Uh, I guess we should go for a scout vehicle first. Yep. The APC is coming out, baby. Oh, yeah. You know. Leave the garage. Oh. Russia. But snow. Snow absolutely everywhere. I'm going to feel so rusty. I've not played this game in so long. New objective discovered. Self-contained antique. Hmm. So I've heard the main objective for this new map is to basically find a bomber that's landed or crashed somewhere. Sounds insane. Uh, I guess we should just explore first. Yes. The watchtower seems like a very good idea. I'm going to be... I'm pressing all the wrong buttons. It's incredible how rusty you get. I do play a lot of games. That That is also a factor, I guess. I'm so excited, though. A new map. If you guys want me to, of course, play this new map, explore, find the new vehicles, please let me know and uh, expect videos back to maybe being daily again. Who knows? It depends on the response, to be honest. I don't know if people are just going to be generally like, yeah, we're, we're done, Scott. <laughs> You stopped, and I will never let you return again. How do we get to that watchtower? Uh, could just cross here. I'm going to see if I can cross there, and then just go straight down. Let's find out. Let's do it. I've been playing F1 recently, and the pace is obviously... For an obvious reason, it's completely different. So different. It's kind of weird. And, oh, look at a little town! Look at it! A new map. I always get so excited for new maps. New vehicles and new maps. I, I'm, I'm done. I'm happy. I am a happy bunny. These deserted places have a charm of their own, don't, don't you think? I, I, yeah, I guess so. Uh, I even used to work here some 30 years ago. Wow. Never mind. Uh, it used to be a factory. Let's go and take a look. And see how it's holding up. Sounds like fun. Sounds like fun. Right, anyway. Let's get to this watchtower. Is that a church? Or a cathedral? I almost forgot how good this game looks. Wow. Uh, that looks steep. <laughs> Where the hell is this watchtower? There's so many tasks. Yeah, obviously you need the season pass. I believe there is... Uh, oh, oh, on thin ice. Ooh, what is this? That is some bad luck. I drove my SUV into the marshes and the engine died. Oh, I'll accept the quest. I may rescue it at some point. Right, let's keep going. Yeah, I sort of forgot just how pretty this game is. How did I... Really? There's a sharp rock. These might be some of the most tricky conditions 
would have ever experienced this map might be anyway. I know about the um, the ice, which sounds terrifying. So maybe weight becomes an issue. If your vehicle's too heavy, it just cracks through the ice. Well, wouldn't that be golden? Oh, we're getting closer to the watchtower. The hunt is on. Please don't smack a rock. I'm really surprised that the vehicle took that much damage from a slight hit on a rock. I'm, uh, yeah, I'm in shock. There it is. Our first watchtower. Yeah, I'm really pleased, though. They're supporting the game. I'm so happy. Obviously, I paid for the season pass, so... I guess I would expect them to support the game, but still... They've given us enough time to play the base game. They released another map, of course, already. The, the content's coming out in a, in a good in a good speed. Watchtower. I'm trying to turn. This does not have the best turning circle, as we know. There we go. Look at that. I believe there's new weather as well, which I know sounds a bit a bit odd, but believe me. When it happens, you'll notice. It looks incredible. Absolutely incredible. Oh, look at this. Oh! There's loads of tasks. Right, where is the next... Is this quite a big map? Oh, wow. Two watchtowers. Is that it? Okay, it's not too big, actually. I'll take that back. So if we follow this path here, this main path, that should lead us straight to the next watchtower. Let's do it. I think this has to be some of my, my, my favourite parts of this game. Just exploring the world, to be honest. Exploring new maps. Oh yeah, does anything look like a vehicle? <laughs> I need to find a vehicle. I know for a fact there's at least one. There has to be at least one vehicle on this map. There has to be. I know it! I'm determined to find it. What we're going to do, probably, is explore the map first. And then we'll probably do some uh, little tasks here and there. Sounds like a plan. Turn. Turn. Plus. Game is running really nicely, actually, as well. Maybe they've done a little bit of optimization. With the next update, we can edit the interiors. Ooh. I know that sounds... A bit basic, but oh yes. Uh, people spend hours upon hours with these interiors. You can eventually add a little hanging dice from the uh, the wing mirror and stuff like that. It is snowy. A new region as well. Not just a new map, a new region. Bumpity bump. Screw you trees. I didn't realise how much I missed this game. I've missed it a lot. I just want to double check we are going the right way. Yeah, stick to this route, so turn left. There's our first look at maybe some broken ice. Yeah, it sounds different. It did sound very different. It almost sounded like we was hitting trees, but that was definitely ice. You could hear the ice cracking. Oh, I think there might be a frozen lake somewhere. Don't quote me on that, but yeah. Using a fair amount of fuel, but obviously we got the roof rack, so we're good. Don't panic, guys, don't panic. Honestly, cannot believe how, how crazy this series was. Like, the support on it was unbelievable especially in the early episodes i was completely completely taken back also they've released a mud, mud runner on mobile if you guys want me to check it out feel free to let me know as well it's ice again <gasps> oh oh my god that is cool oh my god that is really nice 
and very terrifying because as you know as you guys know this vehicle is great but it doesn't like water so you have to be a little bit careful might have to go into a bit of a low here low gear oh it's, is it stuck oh man this ice is horrible might have to use a winch what no surely not am i creeping forward tiny bit and we are pretty stuck here oh ice is so cool it's so good right let's try and winch ourselves out there we go that might be enough maybe not it's also really hard to notice obviously i'd noticed it but i was like fully focused on what i was doing i was like is that is that is i was very suspicious what's that uh is that buggy oh there you go um was that buggy right, i think we're good now Woo. So does that ice stay cracked now? <laughs> oh man. That is terrifying. Just want to double check we're going the right way. So the watchtower's over there. I'm going to make a decision here to go left or straight. Again, any vehicles nearby? You can normally tell on the map if something looks a little bit suspicious. But it might even be a contract. Save this vehicle and you get the vehicle for free. Oh, it's snowing! Yep. Officially, ice is terrifying. One thing this game does so well is the terrain. And ice, they've smashed it. Literally. <laughs> it's so good. It's so good. I'm going to go left here. I'm making the call. I made the call. I can see it just in the foreground. Is that ice again? Oh. Oh, one sec. There is a little path. Hmm. Let's just set a waypoint. I might just drive towards it. Muddy and icy. Yep. Fantastic. <laughs> it's a good sound, though. I've never driven over ice before, not like this anyway. So I don't really know what it sounds like, but it sounds pretty authentic. I'm just going to drive to the watchtower. Screw it. I'm going to trample what is ever in my way. Uh, also, if you guys happen to now want the game, there's a link in the description below to the PC version and the console version. So feel free. It's an um, affiliate link, so I get a little kickback, so I appreciate all the support there. I've loved every second of this game. And I do not say that lightly. Lightly. Loon's observation. Even the music's a bit different. So there's one last... Oh, is this the lake? Oh, that looks terrifying. Yeah, that's the lake. And there. Oh, not sure about this. <laughs> not sure at all. No, no, no. All right, okay. Let's set up an objective point. Self-contained antique. Hmm. Yeah, we're still looking for that bomber plane. And uh, believe me, that is an ambitious delivery. It's massive. I'm not sure if it's going to be the biggest delivery we've ever made. Obviously, this map is quite tricky with the ice. What's the most safest and direct route? Probably go that way. I'll just turn around. First impressions, though. Whoa, look at that sky. First impressions. Really like the map so far. Obviously, super early impressions, of course, but still. Bouncy bounce. Bouncy bounce. 
can see a little house. Can I get through here? I'm now having doubts. Yeah, minor doubts. Minor doubts. Oof. Please don't get stuck, Scotty. There we go. Done. Easy. Easy peasy. Oh, look at that sky. Wow. Except. There you go. It's been activated. So, what route do we take here? There's a big fat rock right here. That looks like a frozen lake to me. <laughs> we are going to be so screwed. I'll give it a go. If it goes wrong, I mean, all I can do is apologize. That's all I can do. That's all I can do. Let's give it a go, though. I used to cross this lake at some point. Oh, man. What is that? <laughs> oh, game, please have mercy. Yeah, that is definitely ice. Oh, no. <laughs> See, I'm wondering now, if we was in a heavier vehicle with a heavy trailer, would we just collapse through this right now? Oh, you can see the cracks already. I can't hear it cracking because of our vehicle. So that's a, that's a positive. Okay, I think we made it. I was half expecting to just crack through that. But we're good. We're okay. We're all good. The, we'll see the amount of... The amount of comments and tweets I've got saying thank you Scott for like, playing this game. I absolutely love it. I wouldn't have played it without your videos and stuff. Honestly, it's incredible. We're actually getting quite close. So cool getting comments like that. So I, I know how much I love video games. And the amount of times I used to watch videos when I was younger. Can I afford this game? I want to get this game. Never heard of this game. And all of a sudden I'm like playing it. And it's one of the best games I've ever played. I'm, I'm, I'm glad I'm here to help. The watchtower is just there. I'm not sure I'm taking the best route here. Yeah, this is slippy. Wow. It doesn't even look that hilly. Let's give it another go. There we go. I'm skidding along. I have zero grip right now. I'm in love! Uh, as far as I know, this is the last watchtower. Yes! Sorry, trees. And there we go. Right, so that was the last watchtower, but I've just noticed there's actually a task all the way up here. So the map must be pretty big. So I thought what we're going to do first is check out this army reserve. I don't know what it is. I guess we're going to go and find out. Yeah, loads of objectives found. So yeah, it's just over there. That is a railway yard. It's kind of a nosy. I have a feeling this map is going to be... Let's turn the lights on there, actually. It's going to be a very pretty map at night. Yes, yes, yes. Oh, ice again. Oh, wow. It, does, it really does surprise you. It's sneaky ice. Obviously, once you've gone through it once, it should sort of stay broken. I'm guessing. Um, I, yeah, I don't know. Maybe it does go back. Yeah, let's go to this. Army reserves. I'm pretty sure that was the last watchtower. I might be wrong. 
no idea. So I don't know if season one we're going to get more maps in this region, or if other seasons add maps to this region. I don't know how it's going to work. I did, I, must admit, I did think there was not many snow maps, considering the game is called SnowRunner. <laughs> so I'm glad we got more. No doubt. Right, what was that clear as this? Let's have a look. Except that is a lot of money. Here goes. There is a bunker up north. Not like one of the coastal ones. Uh, this one is newer. A friend of mine spotted an interesting looking box there. Okay, so it's a secure container. Uh, we need a truck with a crane. So this is a little explore mission, which might be quite a good, uh, a good idea. So there are plenty of houses here that have been empty since the war. You never know what you may find in those places. A flask, a helmet, a personal belonging. If you see an interesting spot, please let us know. So I'm going to start tracking that. Because there is one right here. The ruined, is that, that is, yeah, ruined warehouse. It's really close. So I might have a little nosy. Oh man, this map is actually really big. It, it's weird though, the... It doesn't quite make any sense in terms of the watchtowers. Looks like the map is at least double what we've explored so far. Yeah, odd. Right, let's go to the ruined warehouse first and let's see what we can find. Again, this was just a little contract I found at the railway station. The railway station. There you go. I can say it properly. What happened to this road? Ow! What the? Really? See, so yeah, it looks like I've lost two wheels. Whoops. Uh, I've lost... I need to try and fix the gas tank, really. And suspension's still a bit damaged, but it will do for now. Also, now the roof rack is completely empty. So, yep, yeah, all gone. Ruined warehouse. I'm almost 100% sure in the past those oh, those little gas tanks have just stayed there. But now it looks like they disappear when I use them. Yeah, suspension is still completely ruined. But it, it should be drivable. <laughs> I've actually taken a lot of damage in this episode, which was not planned. I guess I'm a bit, uh, a bit rusty. It's fair to say. Very rusty. Right. Oh, sorry. Coming through. Yeah, this place is ruined. This used to be a warehouse? When? You sure? So that's one area explored. Not really much here, to be honest. Do I keep going? This map is humongous. Absolutely humongous. Let's keep going straight. Even though it is late. Can I go through that fence? Yes. I <laughs> just went straight through it. Okay, then. Oh, what the? Oh, wow. What? That's incredible. Oh, my. Look at that. What an incredible map. I am absolutely in awe. Look at that. Incredible. I'm just taking it in right now. What awesome, awesome DLC. Ow! I swear the vehicles are now more fragile, apparently. <laughs> apparently that's the case. Guardhouse on the rocks. That seems really far away. If we can get there. Looks fairly flat, though, to be honest. Apart from the, uh, the lake. The ice lake of doom. Again, keep an eye on the map. We're trying to find the vehicle as well. This does not look safe whatsoever. Look at that. Oh. Remember, this vehicle does not like water. <laughs> Anything here? Yep. A little contract, which I will collect. Bit off the old beaten path. Try and 
trying to see if there's like a, maybe like a reward, a free vehicle, <laughs> potentially. I've seen some decent money though. There's so many contracts and tasks and main missions to do as well. Frozen in time. Right, let's keep going. Can I get across that without the ice breaking? Guess we're gonna find out. Uh, oh, that's a no. Okay, we might be in trouble here. Because, as far as I can tell, there is nothing to winch on. We are moving, though. No, yeah, no visible winch points. Oh, we might be stuck. This vehicle hates water so much. Ice is horrible. Ice might be the trickiest terrain in the game. You just have no grip, and then you're in the water. Oh, we might get through this. That's why you never give up. Yes! That is what you call determination. Beautiful! That honestly might be one of the most prettiest skies I've ever seen in a video game. That is unreal. What's, what's happened here? I'm now beached on a rock. I was so focused on the sky. Oh, you got to be kidding me. There you go. I was looking at the sky. I was not looking where I was going. Oopsie. I was like, there's no ice here. I'm all good. Uh, 160 litres of fuel left. So many rocks. I think this might go down as the trickiest map in the game. Yeah. It might be official. So coming up to the guardhouse. There's a bunch of stuff over here as well. Look at that. This map is massive. Humongous. Actually, what I should do is set a waypoint because I do not want to get lost. I'm going to try and avoid the ice if I can I like the solid ground more bounce the bounce Guard house on the rock. Again, doesn't look in the best state. No, it does not look in a good state whatsoever. At least we arrived. So that's done. Next one is just over here. Forest cabin. Luckily, the other two are pretty close to the garage. So these are probably the trickier ones. Do not get stuck on that, that diddy little tree. I believe we are out of the woods, literally there. <laughs> it's getting a little bit stuck. Again, getting stuck like that just wastes your fuel. It's so pointless. It's so horrible, but obviously that's, that's part of the game. You're, you're supposed to get a bit stuck. Just how it goes. Oh, here we go. Here we go. I can't imagine this vehicle being the most balanced as well. The weight isn't evenly distributed. Oh, that just looks weak. Oh, this looks weak. Speed! I did not like that. <laughs> I did not like that at all. It's a terrifying sound when you hear that. Oh! 
But the vehicle might need rescuing. And I'm wondering if there's a vehicle we can keep. Let's find out. Knee deep. It is, I believe... No. That is not a vehicle we keep. Damn you, game. You tricked me. Oh my god. 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 So there's this foreign tourist. He really wants some uh, some live history. Ended up almost going under the ice. Uh, will you help me pull him out? I will make it worth your time. So get some, get some money. Get some XP. And we get the vehicle. A brand new vehicle for the game. Oh man. Where did... Where do I need to go to? That's quite a long way, isn't it? That's quite a long way. That's where we've got to drop it off. So we've got to pick it up from there. Drop it off here. I mean, really, I need some fuel. I really need some fuel. If I'm going to do that. That's a long way. No. Oh, that's agonizing. What we're going to do, though, is pause it there. Let me know in the comments. What should I do? Should I just try and give it a go with the limited amount of fuel we have? Oh, decisions. Decisions. What a crazy map, though. So much fun. I love the new IS mechanic as well. Yeah, really cool addition to SnowRunner. Thank you guys for watching. Leave a like on the video, and I will see you guys very soon. Bye-bye.